Welcome to my channel, Planner with Maserati. I'm going to be doing the daily scripture writing for July 26, which is 1 Peter 2.16. So welcome, please subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. If you could give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. So with that being said, let's go ahead and begin. So for the month of July, we're focused on freedom. And again, July 26 is 1 Peter 2.16. Our soap study, scripture, observation, application, and prayer. We read, write, pray, and reflect. I like how people do the S-O-A-P. I don't feel that's enough room for me, but I would love to do that. And we turn the page. We are on Walk in Freedom. It's a five-day devotional. So yeah, let's go ahead and begin. I have been so MIA. So am I so much that I'm so far behind. So 1 Peter 2.16. So here is 1 Peter 2 and 16 is here. It says, I live as free people. I'm sorry, it doesn't say I live. It says, live as free people, but do not use your freedom as a cover-up for evil. Live as God's slaves. I'd rather be God's slaves than the world's slaves. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'd rather be in God's world than in the worldly world. I don't know if that makes sense. So let's say it again. Live as free people, but do not use your freedom as a cover-up for evil. Live as God's slaves. So how have you been? How's your family? You know, I'm jumping right in and doing this. I'm doing this. Yeah, this worldly world thing is got to go. Like, it is terrible. And people say it's, and I say it too to other people, it's how you make, you know, your life. It's how you make of it. But sometimes that's not the case. Like, Sometimes you could work your butt off and just still not, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it. Just know that this world is corrupted, crazy. Oh, just things that go on in this world is like sad. Like a three-year-old, she got pow-powed. Hopefully she makes it. You know, I mean, not a three-year-old, a three-month-old. Hopefully she makes it, or he makes it. I don't know if it's a he or she. And um, it, that's just, to me, that's crazy. I have a three-year-old grandson and a little over one-and-a-half-year-old grandson. And so two grandbabies. I could never, never, ever, ever fathom the thought that anything like that could happen to them. Never could I ever. Yeah, so it's just this world is a little on the crazy side for me. And we should be focused more on the Lord than anything else. Like we, we pay attention to the little things. We argue about the dumbest things. We just I don't know. I feel like I'm just grabbing a piece of paper. I feel like that it's just our, what we focus on is not what we should be focused on. So I'm going to set up July 27th. Like these little arguments you have with your spouse, your family, and then you hear bad news on the news every single day. And you're like, is that worth it? Was that worth that argument? So 2 Peter 2.18 through 22 is going to be for the 27th. I don't know. I just feel like this world is going nuts. Like, what is going on, people? That's why I said I'm going to stay in my faith. That's for sure. And I just got some beautiful dresses from Bloom Chic. 
They range from size 10 to 30, if these guys are interested. They range from size 10 to 30. I can link, you know, my TikTok shop and you can see them. And the thing with that is, they're beautiful dresses. I'm like, where am I going to go with these dresses? They're beautiful. Well, obviously, it's a church, right? That's where I should be going, to church with those dresses. So I'm just going to lift this up here so I can do some other stuff with it. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and give it a big thumbs up. I like to rant a little bit. I don't know why, but that's just... It's just been on my heart. Like, what is going on in this world is... It's shameful. And it's just really shameful. Okay, I'll talk to you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.